funny. Oh, this is so cool. This is actually working out better than I thought it would. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. What's going on, my geeks? I'm Kakui Otaka, and welcome to Homebase Serenity, where today I'm back with what is potentially the first video in a new loadout series that I'm considering doing, where the featured loadout might not be the meta build for a hero, but it's just a super fun loadout. You could even call it a meme build if you wanted. I don't like where this is going. I wasn't planning on making this a series originally, but after the first one turned out to be so much fun, I thought it might be a fun new series to do. The inspiration for this video came when I decided I wanted to make a loadout video based around the hero I consider to be my first ever main in Save the World, Sarah Claus. Sarah. She's coming in town. Sarah. Ah! Oh my god! Boy, have you lost your when Epic did the hero rework almost two years ago now, they renamed her Alchemist Sarah, and as with all the other heroes, gave her a unique commander and support perk. Now she's mostly a smoke bomb hero, Ooh. as her perk, Medicinal Fumes, heals yourself and allies for 31 base health per second, or 10 base health in support, while still doing damage to the husks at a decent rate. The damage is not amazing, but it can be very helpful still. Alrighty then. These changes were really disappointed in me when it happened as I always loved the look of this Sarah, but I just didn't feel like a hero that focused on smoke bomb will be viable. But perhaps I was wrong. Mr. Makus, you're wrong. Wrong? As in not right? That's what we're here today to find out. Death Grip and I put together what I think is a pretty decent loadout here. The idea was that we wanted to see just how much we could buff her smoke bomb and see if she can be effective with only using smoke bomb and nothing else. So to go on to the loadout, I'm starting with a very appropriate team perk, Happy Holidays, which lowers ability cooldowns by 40%, stacking on top of any other ability cooldowns. Merry Christmas, you filthy animal. The first hero in support is Thunderstruck strike Mari and her Dragon Days perk, which knocks back and stuns nearby enemies for one second when your shield breaks. Next up is a pirate hero. Why is the rum gone? Freebooter Ken and his Sea Fog perk, which allows Smoke Bomb to restore your shields to full as soon as it's used. After that, I have Dim Mock Mari and her Utility Belt perk which decreases smoke bomb cooldown another 18% on top of the 40% from Happy Holidays. Then I have Prehistoric Itza, who increases your armor by 33 when you have no shield. And lastly, Tricera Ops Ramirez, who heals you 2.125% of your base health per second. The main idea of all of this is to give you the best buffs you can get to Smoke Bomb while also giving you some survivability since you're going to be up in the faces of the husks the whole time. And as always, I've rounded out the loadout with my standard stationary hover turrets and adrenaline rush. Although, you could also swap the hover turrets for slow field, and that honestly might even be better. Before we go into the gameplay, I want to apologize for the video quality here. I tried something new and tried to record in Streamlabs OBS while streaming to see if I could get better quality than just downloading loading the VOD and, well, the results were not great. Yeah. That went well. But this is what I have to work with, and I didn't want to redo it because the gameplay was so fun, so it is what it is. So let's jump into this power level 132 encampment mission that I did on stream with Death Grip and Frost, where all three of us were using the Sarah Claus loadout and see how it went. Take out the enemies to all clear right. the Smoke bomb. I've still got like 20 seconds on the cooldown. Yeah, I know. So we'll have to just kind of run around and dodge. <laughs> yeah. I was getting hit by the Taker and like burning from stuff and still survived. Oh gosh, I just died. Taker shot me out of the air. Well, slapped me out of the air, I guess. <laughs> All right, we got to group them up together. So the cooldown's not too bad, obviously. I mean, with the Happy Holidays and with the decreased cooldown, it's only like a 20 second cooldown. So it's not too bad. Yeah. Never hey, mind. there we go. It would be kind of funny if we somehow oh, no. okay, we defeat this whole thing with just, just smoke yeah. bombs. <laughs> it'll get, it'll get really tricky there at the, uh, the next part where we oh, get yeah. those super I imagine so. And yeet. All right, here we go. We just gotta time it. Yep. All right, here we go. Boom. Here's mine. Two seconds. Yeet. Yeah, blasters down. <laughs> <laughs> 
This is the actually kind of fun. Dragon Days helps stun him too, yeah. I mean, yeah. it's slow, but it's still a lot of fun. And throwing mine down. Ready. Yeah, right. even the blaster was targeting you the whole time. <laughs> and he couldn't hit you. Yeah. They're out healing bees and everything. Exactly. This is awesome. <laughs> that works. All right, Smasher is right here. We yeah, let's, I want to see what this does Get him at the same time. No one, one right. two, three. Where to go? <laughs> Whoops. Bruh. <laughs> yeah, we just killed a smasher with smoke bomb. <laughs> That's amazing. Smoke. <laughs> oh, that's good. Here we go. Try it on the blaster. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> the dragon days knocked him back. Yeet. I think we missed time that a little bit. That's all good. Maybe. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, he's got <laughs> double. He gets he stunned. He got it twice. <laughs> yeah. Question will be, can we finish this in time? <laughs> That's the, the only one. thing. It's like, we could, we could We've probably do it. We've got three done. we got three done now. So, yeah. we're only... Well, the super encampments, too, is the other issue. Well, yeah, as right. long as we finish the, the first five that we're done. I'm throwing mine down. All right. Oh, the randoms ruining it. Yeah. About to throw mine here. And they all get stunned. The that Dragon Days is really fun. Yeah, it actually is. I've never used it before, but I like it. Oh, wait, he just he just went away. The random just he stopped doing away. things. Yeah, throwing it. Nice. You have a band with, like, armor on it. I have, like, actually, we have one, actually. All right, yeah, throwing mine. Oh. <laughs> That's all right. It's, like, 73,000 damage per hit. It's pretty good. It's not bad. <laughs> There's oh, even this is like ridiculous. three blasters chilling out there in the in the open, just like shooting at us. Alright, I'm throwing mine down. Here you go. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Going to <laughs> We're just absolutely like in a cloud of enemies and just tanking through it. That's pretty funny. Oh, this is so cool. This is actually working out better than I thought it would. Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying. Alright, we got super encampments right now. Now this is gonna be the real test here. Oh we got takers too, yeah. That's all good. We'll use the slow field here a little bit. Got two seconds and I can throw mine down. Got six. There we go. Come here, <laughs> <laughs> Alright, somebody else throw theirs. Right. I got these over here. Wow, even with takers, blasters, all kinds of stuff. Super encampment. Doesn't even matter. Alright. Here we go again. I don't oh have well. A smoke bomb right now. I do. Throw it down. Hell yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I had to use Still adrenaline surviving. rush. I was I was getting real low there for a second. It's slow but effective. Yeah, that's what's crazy about it. Like, <laughs> if you really wanted to be like the dedicated healer for your team, you, you, you definitely could. Like oh, do yeah. a really good job of it. I'm standing on a bunch of husks heads. <laughs> so the funny thing about this is that this loadout definitely turned out to be more fun than I thought it would be. I still cannot believe that we took down so many encampments with basically only smoke bomb, except for that little bit of help from the random at one point. But I think they figured out what we were doing and let us do our thing, so I'm very appreciative of that. This will most likely be the last video uh, that I upload on this channel this year. So next up will hopefully be a special 2020 wrap-up video looking back at the positives from this year for my channel that I hope will inspire us all to look back and find the positives in our own lives amidst all the bad in 2020. After that, I'll be getting back to the comic book legends loadouts, the gameplay for which will be recorded live on stream at twitch.tv forward slash homebase serenity. So make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel and hit the notification bell if you want to see those videos as soon as they go live. And make sure to come and follow me on Twitch so you can steal the fun we have over there as well. With Epic Supported Creator applications reopened, I am on the road to 1000 so I can apply for a Supported Creator code and anything earned from that should I ever get a code and if anyone decides to use it will be put back into my content. I still can't wrap my mind around all of the support you have all shown me on both platforms so far. I'm going to go into that a bit more in the 2020 wrap up video, but thank you all so much for spending some of your time watching my videos or watching me stream. I truly mean it when I say that I love you all. Lastly, as always, special shout outs to my favorite Save the World content creators, both past and present Latana, Demon Joe France, David Dean, Tori X, Aiden Harris, 
Ice, Rounded Tic Tac, A1 Get This Money, Death Grip, Viva Vanti, It's Zoot, Wizard, Gongus, and Jet Cool Extreme. I've linked all their channels and some others down below, so please make sure to go and show them some love. Thanks again for watching, everyone, and stay cool, geeks. Have a great day. Merry belated Christmas if you celebrate. If you don't, then happy holidays, and please stay safe out there.